Okay guys, let's free up a space on your MacBook. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you the easiest way to free up a space on your MacBook, especially if you use your MacBook to edit YouTube videos or another type of videos, and you see this message on your screen saying like your disk is almost full. Let's go. Okay guys, I'm gonna be using the MacBook Pro 2019, but you can do this on any MacBook. So the first thing we're gonna do, let's go ahead and click on the Apple logo on the left side on the top, then let's go ahead and click on about this Mac. Perfect. Now let's go ahead and click on storage. And then let's go ahead and click on manage. So on this page, you're going to see different categories. So that's the good thing about Mac. It's easier than Windows computer to free up space. Let me show you why. So right here, let's go ahead and click on the first one, application. You're going to be able to see all the apps that you have on your MacBook. So the good thing about that, guys, is if you click on one of those apps, you can just remove this app really easy as soon as you click on the app you're gonna see on the bottom right here the delete button just click on that and you're gonna remove all those apps that are using your computer space so but just make sure you're gonna delete obviously the apps that you don't need on your computer sometimes we have apps on the computer that we not even know that we have them so just click on each one then let's go ahead and click on delete like right now numbers i don't use the app the app right now is using 220 megabytes okay on my computer space let's go ahead and click on delete and as soon as i delete the app automatically will have more space available on my computer obviously so you're gonna select all the app that you don't need guys so that's the good thing like i said about macbook because it's really really easy for you to delete stuff that you don't need on your computer so then let's go ahead and click on document as you can see that's the um, main category on your computer that use the most uh, space on your computer. Let's jump to the next category. So it's going to be document. So as you can see, document right now is using almost 700 gigs out of my computer space. It's a lot. So it's a lot because right here on this category on document, we have large files, download, unsupported apps, containers and file browsers so that means you know that's the reason why document category is using a lot of space on this computer on any computer so first of all let's go ahead and click on large files then scroll the way down and you're gonna see all the large files that are using space on your computer so at the top you will see any software for editing if you use like iMovie or another software to edit videos you will see it at the top because um, those software use a lot of space on your computer. Right now I'm using iMovie to edit all my videos. As you can see, iMovie is taking, is using a lot of space, it's using 514 gigs out of my computer space. That is a lot. But before we jump into that, scroll down and you will see more files that actually are using a lot of space on your computer. So I recommend you just select one of them and automatically you will see right here the delete button to delete that video. But before you delete that video, I recommend you to double click on it and make sure you don't need it. You know what I mean? Because right here, you not even can tell what type of video is that. So you will have to open it to make sure if you really need the video or not. If you don't need it, just select the video and then let's go ahead and click on delete. And automatically, you will free up 10 gigs. <laughs> 10 gigs is a lot of gigs, yo. So and if you delete a lot of videos right here, you will definitely free up a lot of space on your computer. But guys, the main thing right here is the um, editor. So the iMovie in this case is using 500 gigs. So what I'm gonna do, or what you have to do, any software that you see right here to edit videos, let's go ahead and double click on it. That will open the software. Okay guys, the main reason why editor use a lot of space on your computer is because you have to delete all those projects that you already have done okay like for example right now let me delete this one i just click on it those three dots and then delete project you maybe already did on your computer and you still don't have space on your computer don't worry about it i'm going to show you why but first of all if you haven't do that just click on each project and delete all of them all those projects guys Okay, so after you do that, let's go ahead and create a new project right here. Then let's go ahead and click on iMovie Library. So you will see different projects right here that you already delete, but they are still on your computer. 
you will have to select one by one of those projects and delete them manually. Like for example, let me delete this one. Uh, let me just click on it and then delete event. So right now I don't have a lot of event right here because I do that almost every day. In your case, if you didn't know that you have to delete all those events, you will have a lot right here, a long list. Just uh, select them one by one and delete them. And that way you will free up a lot of space. After you do all that, you will have to restart your MacBook. Let's go ahead and click on the Apple logo, left side on the top then restart your computer and that will free up a lot of space guys a lot of space after you do all that let's go ahead and click on the apple logo on the left side one more time then let's go ahead and click on about this mac then let's go ahead and click on storage and manage okay so let's keep going on this uh, page right here so we are ready uh work on document then let's go ahead and click on messages it's using almost 400 megabytes it's not a lot but if you don't need those messages just delete them so it's like trash you know what i mean just delete all those messages then let's go ahead and click on music then music creation trash and all that okay guys after you delete all the files videos that you don't need on this computer so we finally have to do the last thing uh, you can close all those windows then let's go ahead and open the trash icon and you have to delete everything that is in here because even if you delete right now this folder, it's going straight to the um, this um, the trash. You will have to click on empty. You have to empty the trash can, and that will finally free up the space on your computer. That's the last thing you have to do. After you do everything, after you do all that, I recommend you to restart your computer one more time. Just click on the Apple logo on the left side. Then let's go ahead and click on restart and restart your computer and i promise you that will free up a lot of space on your computer that's the only way it's easier than a windows uh, computer because on apple computers those categories are more organized by clicking on each file you're gonna be able to delete them right away and that's all you need to do guys if you have any question please let me know don't forget to subscribe hit the like button see you in my next video